Welcome back to Tent Talk. And throughout the last week or two, I don't know why it's just this week or two, everybody is asking what Plotter Cut program I use. I use film and vinyl designs. I use it for a couple big reasons. Actually, a few big reasons. But the number one reason I'm going to get right into it is because they have so many different types of visor strips and windshield, windshield patterns for whatever car you're going to be using now. Uh, for the most part, I mean, there are very few cars that they don't have windshields for and that might be like some 95s or 94s or you know something like that or older but for the most part you have so many different windshield patterns for each type like this is just a 2023 uh honda accord right here as you can see and they still have one two three four five six different type of windshield patterns for it and then they have all the different type of visor strips for that windshield pattern like look you get a plethora of patterns with film and vinyl designs um you get the up here this would be uh i guess you can consider this like um the new school laser cut which everybody likes they like well i want the visor strip to be straight i don't want it to look all you know feathered out and rainbow like this so you can do the new school ones like whatever whatever for each windshield they have it on there um they have it where you go around the frames around the uh rear view mirrors you can go through it and then you can do your own thing if it's aftermarket glass or whatever but they give you so many options on that that's one of my favorite things about film and vinyl designs actually that's probably man it might be tied for my other favorite three thing on here um so the other thing about uh film and vinyl designs that i really 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 enjoy okay so if i go up here to the open database you open pattern right and you can even see this look at this a 2023 through 2024 honda sedan and their years are like always spot on man always spot on they have so they have you're not going to miss a car on here um so you have this s is for small and the l is for the large patterns and then they even tell you the difficulty so for the large pattern it's a 4.5 difficulty for the small pattern, it's a 4.5 difficulty, but a lot of different cars, sometimes it'll have a different difficulty for the, the size of the pattern. But either way you put it, it shows you the difficulty of the pattern, which you should be charging, this and that, yada, yada, yada. Um, but even that's pretty cool stuff. For me, I always go with the small patterns. Um, and that being, when you, you start using the small patterns off of the rip, you're going to be like, man, this pattern doesn't cover, but you'll get used to, um, tinting like this and you'll understand where the film should actually go. So after a while, you're going to be like, okay, I understand that. But, um, at the end of the day, I personally, I, uh, print out cars on 30 inch rows, most cars on 30 inch rows. So, because I don't like to get a big old, um, 40 inch row unless I really need it or 30 inch, 30 36 inch row unless I really need it so like if I go over here this is 29 inches or whatever 29 inches um, but that can be printed out on a 30 inch row so I can save me some money but you look right here and if you try to um, let me see I don't know if I can do this one hand but if you were trying to combine both of these row both of these it would be something around like 31 inches so it couldn't be necessarily printed out on a 30 inch row until you flip the pattern and i do my little trick right here um i'll tell you guys this is why i love 30 inch rows and a lot of people don't know how to use the, a lot of people don't buy 30 inch rows because they don't know the plotter trick um, but if you know the plotter trick you can get 30 inch rows you just do it like that and i'm using one hand so you'll lose about like two maybe two or three inches or whatever like that but at the end of the day this will get you able to print out a 30 inch row if you stack the patterns like this whatever whatever and then you know i can't use two hands right now because i have to hit control or whatever but you can stack the patterns like that but that's man uh, another great thing about uh film vinyl designs um it works with the titan plotters also it's fully compatible with titan plotters it works well with the titan plotter so i can't i can't man i love this uh plotter pro cut program but yes this is what i use film and vinyl designs um the price is amazing uh the, you, you know communicating with the people it's pretty good also um i like it i use a lot of different product uh, cut programs and they just you know they were cool but when i, I discovered this it was a new ball game 
it was just a new ball game. This, yeah, film vinyl designs for sure for window 10. All right, like and subscribe, you guys. See you guys next time.